Hey guys, it's Alyssa from AlyssaDeLoney.com. Welcome back to my channel. Happy September! We are at the beginning of a brand new month, and today we are starting a brand new week in Club 119. This is week 10 in our scripture journaling series, and this is video number 19. I cannot believe that we have made it this far. <laughs> it feels like we just started, and it also feels like we've been at it for quite some time. But um, I'm just thrilled to see this group continue to grow and flourish. And like I always say, I hope it's been a blessing to you. If you've just stumbled across this video and you're not quite sure what's going on or what Club 119 is, then I invite you to check out the description box and you will find a Welcome to Club 119 video. In that video, I talk about what Club 119 is and how you can get started. Now this is the 10th week out of 11 weeks in this particular series, so we're nearing the end, but you can always watch the videos at your own pace and follow along on your own time. But at the end of this month of September, um, I'll be starting season number two and you can jump in on that season when we get started. Now, as you can see, I kept the spread really simple. I just used some pictures that I had gotten off of Pinterest and rounded the corners with my corner punch and pasted them in. Let me go ahead and start reading the scriptures for today. This is the 19th video, which means we are in the 19th stanza, and that covers verses 145 to 152. And as always, I will be both reading and writing out of the New King James Version. I cry out with my whole heart. Hear me, O Lord, I will keep your statutes. I cry out to you, save me and I will keep your testimonies. I rise before the dawning of the morning and cry for help. I hope in your word. My eyes are awake through the night watches that I may meditate on your word. Hear my voice according to your loving kindness, O Lord, revive me according to your justice. They draw near who follow after wickedness they are far from your law. You are near, O Lord, and all your commandments are truth. Concerning your testimonies, I have known of old that you have founded them forever. Now today, instead of a discussion question, I have an activity for you. I invite you to open up to a blank page in your journal and take maybe about five to 10 minutes to write out a gratitude list. Now this can include anything and everything from the smaller, maybe seemingly more mundane things in your life to the big wins and victories or the answers to challenging problems um, and everything else that falls in between. I just invite you to fill up as much of the page as you can. God does so much for us every single moment of every single day, we should be able to write pages and pages and pages of things that we are grateful for. But you don't have to write pages and pages, just one. If you can't do it all in one sitting, then maybe you can keep your journal open on your desk or on the counter or someplace where you will come across it throughout the day and just jot things down as they come to you. Whatever you have to do to get that one page, I challenge you to get it done. Now, just in case you missed it, last week I did not post my regular Monday and Wednesday videos for stanzas 17 and 18. And that's because on Monday I did a live session on YouTube and covered the material for stanzas 17 and 18. So I just wanted to make sure that if you're missing those two videos, stanzas 17 and 18, be sure and watch the replay of the live where I go over the discussion questions and all of that, as well as chat with some of you guys and answer questions and just have a good time. And also because I got a couple of questions about my spreads from those stanzas, here is what they looked like.
I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you all later. Bye-bye.